This is bad for all of us. The alibi. Orange place. Apparently the dress code is optional. You want to talk about clothes? Just imagine yourself in that fashionable prison jumpsuit. Mm -hmm. So, you remembered Mike Houlihan, our seventh grade teacher, fairly obvious. Well, I want you to find me. After all, I'm already on my second vodka martini. You're slowing down. Maybe. You were watching me today. Hmm. Yesterday, too. Milk? You'll be looking for an edge. Because you know I'm going to win this fight. <laughs> Maybe. But before we find out, I want you to know that I owe you. What? Allow me one true non-dissembling statement. It'll be the only one I ever make. I'll never forget what you did for me. Well, you'll have years to reflect. You're under arrest. <laughs> That's it. That's all you can say after all these years. Words fail me. Let me help before you try to take me in. I'm saying thanks. For what? What, making you the fine, upstanding citizen you are today? What I am is my choice. The reason I'm... What I'm thanking you for is that you tried. And uh, I guess I'm a poor study. Yeah, we all have our shortcomings. Me, I lay awake at night worrying about little insignificant things, like you. No small talk. I'm taking you in. That was slow, even by your standards. Hey! This is not a rental. What do you want? I'm here to warn you. Don't get on that plane. After night, I don't worry about you anymore. When did you ever worry about me? You've only got one concern, money. I do what I do for my reasons. Let's go. About the window, I'll write you a check. Where you going? They don't let you have pens. You know, your problem goes back to junior high when I got taller. That's how I remember it. Oh, you bit me, Johnny. I'd go running to Grandma crying, and you get sent to your room. Yeah, well, guess what? Grandma's not here. Yeah. Neither's Nick. Check behind the bar. He's wired to enough explosives to give the alibi a Maryland zip code. You got less than a minute. <laughs> 